Kelly, this is PK Ware from SurfMemay.com, and we have, we're very honored to have Michael from SurfHealthAndFitness.com to, to be here with us. Hi, so I'm Mike from Surf Health and Fitness, and we're going to be taking Kelly and PK through a little surf specific uh, circuit type workout. We're going to be focusing on glutes and core, which is the powerhouse area of every athlete, and as surfers we are athletes, so let's get into it. Yay! Okay, so let's start you guys down on hands and knees. So we're going to start with a little basic warm up just to get the spine moving. And cat cows from yoga, breathing in, arching back, and breathing out as you round out the back into a cat stretch. So let's just do a few of those to get the breath moving and to warm up the spine. And it's also, this movement is part of our first exercise. Okay, which is going to be a plank to a cat. Okay, so let's get you guys down to a surf style plank position, which is just down like you're about to paddle a surfboard. We're going to have elbows down, ready to come up into a plank. Okay, and we're going to breathe out and push up into a, a cat stretched plank. That's it, really arch, round out those backs at the top. That's it, and then breathe in to come back down into that prone surfing position, and then breathe out and back up. Exactly, so we're supported from the knees and elbows, and we breathe in to come back down to that prone paddling position. The second exercise is going to be a standard glute bridge. So let's get you guys on your back, and we all know this one. And it's just hips up and hips down. That's it. Easy as that. So we're not counting repetitions here. This is going to go around. The first round is a warm-up round. Just to get familiar with the exercise. Just go through a few details. So the idea here is to get your hips up as high as possible. And to squeeze the butt and back down. As simple as that. Okay, let's flip you guys over. And straight into... From a plank position, a forearm plank, up into a yoga style plank, and back down. That's it. Let's keep feet shoulder width apart, so you can keep some stability. Really good core exercise. Really good anti-rotation exercise, which is very surf specific as well. That's it. Let's just do a few more as the warm up round goes on. Okay, so strict squats. So strict form squats, find a comfortable width apart, shoulder width apart, toes turned out a little. We're going to get the hands here for balance. We're going to come down until hips are at knee height. Back is straight and back up. That's it. Simple as that. Back stay straight. But knees stay up at, feet, at foot width. And top, feet stay flat as well. Try and have most of your body weight on your heels. Perfect rest. We're going to do another squat, which is a deep squat with a rotation. So when you do a deep squat, you just want to really sit down and stand up. We're going to add a rotation, which as you will see is quite surfy. One side to the other. As simple as that. Perfect. And let's get the breathing in time with the movement. Breathe in to come up and breathe out to go down. Breathe in to come up and breathe out to go down. So that's the two squatting exercises. Another ab exercise we're going to do now, which is from a hollow position into a curl up into a ball. So if you've done Pilates before, you'll know the, the hollow position or the, the hundreds position where your back is flat. And then you're going to curl up into a ball, touch your toes, and then spread out again. If you cannot keep your lower back flat, only go as, so far as you can keep the lower back flat. No arching of the back. And just curl up into a ball, straighten out. Curl up and straighten out. Perfect. That's it, you got it. And let's stand up curtsy lunges. So that instead of doing a normal reverse lunge, we're stepping back to that 45 degree angle. Down. 
perfect. That's it, one side to the other. And let's get hands touching the floor as well. Perfect. How's that feel? Easy? Sort of. But I know, like you said, my butt is going to hurt. Yes, yeah, so it's a great butt exercise for that muscle right on the side of the butt. And as you can see, it kind of Bring, curl, brings you up into a pretzel type shape, which we often, that's a position we often get to in surfing. Okay, so we're gonna, so that's a little warm up round to get in touch with the exercises. Now we're gonna use the, the stopwatch to go through the circuit as a circuit style now, okay? So let's start. Okay, so let's do the first exercise, the glute bridge. So down on backs, knees bent. Hips up. Squeeze the butt. Here we go, your minute begins. Okay. So it's one minute of this exercise. How's it feel? Good. Feel the butt? Up and breathe out to go. Deep breaths. 
Again, we can always modify this by going slower. Or if it's too easy, you can speed it up. If your knees don't feel comfortable going all the way down, just keep it to the half squat, but still add the rotation. 10 more seconds. Good deep breaths. How's it feeling? Seconds, with 10 seconds rest before the next exercise and the next exercise is an ab exercise so let's get lying down and straight into it we're going to go from a ball position so we're curled up into a ball fingertips are touching toes and then we're going to reach out and back lower backs have to stay flat like you see Kelly here her back is staying flat if that's too much PK is going to demonstrate what you can do now which is just the crunch. Just like that. If this feels any lower back pain on, on what Kelly's doing, then we go down to what PK is doing here, which is just a, a simple crunch. She's curling up into a ball still though, and pushing the lower back into the ground. 20 seconds. Keep moving. Perfect technique. Look at that. Starting to feel those abs burning a little. Yes. Good. That's it, we keep moving for one minute. Let's see if we get the breath in time with the movement as well. Two, one, and rest. We've got 10 seconds rest. <coughs> Standing up. The sixth exercise is the curtsy lunge. So here we go, one minute of these. So we step to 45 degrees, touch the floor, and back. Turning? Yep, let's go. One minute. So, that in sync as well. Oh yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. Again, if, if, if anyone's feeling like this is too much to come down here, you can just keep your hands up a bit higher and don't go so low. The idea is to step back at 45 degrees and alternate. That's it. And as you know as surfers we end up in some pretty awkward positions. And this is kind of an awkward position as well. Oh, yeah. It's kind of like a backside turning. Exactly. 10 seconds. So you can get the knee to come down okay. lower to the ground. That's better. So the lower you can get down to the surfboard, the lower your center of gravity. One. And we're going to 10 seconds rest before the next round. So a very short rest, a couple of deep breaths. I'm going to go straight back into the glute bridge, yeah? Two. One, so on backs. Squeeze the butt. Here we go, your minute begins. Okay. So it's one minute of this exercise. How's it feel? Good. Feel the butt? Good. Let's 
this is harder than it looks. Especially when we do it non-stop movement. So we're doing body weight strength exercises as in circuit style. So it's cardio and body weight strength combined. Especially if you saw it yesterday. Yeah. Two, yeah. One. Good. And change. So let's stand up. Strict squats. So find your position. Two. One. And strict squats. One minute. Uh, not too low. Keep your backs really straight. That's it. There we go. Uh, and the breathing. Breathe in. Breathe in to come up and breathe out to go down. Uh, shoulders relax. That's it. I think we can speed it up a little bit. That's it. A little bit faster. Keep those backs nice and strong. 30 seconds in. 30 seconds. Technique is looking really good. How does the eggs feel? Um, last bad is my sweats. 15 seconds to go. Try to keep a nice rhythm, so constantly moving, no rest, always moving. If you're starting to get tired, just make the squat smaller and slow it down. I want you guys to keep moving. Two, one, got 10 seconds rest, breathe, relax. And now exercise number four, the deep squat with the rotations. So drop down, here we go. One minute starts. That's it. So this is a deep squat. So bum all the way down. That's it. Now you can imagine you're surfing here. There we go. Very surf-like this exercise. Don't be afraid to get that butt super low. Bounce out of it. Out of the bottom of the squat. Remember the breathing. So breathe in and breathe out. How does the next go now? Good. We have sore butts tomorrow. A good sore. Probably won't talk to you. You've got 10 more seconds. Remember the breathing. Keep the feet nice and relaxed as well. Imagine you're balanced on a surf, keep those feet nice and flat for one, and we've got 10 seconds rest. We're going to go down to the other ab exercise, which is the hollow to the, to, from the ball position, reaching up and back. If that's too much, remember, it's a crunch.
friends. Ten more seconds. This is the sixth exercise of the second round. Two, one, and rest. You've got ten seconds only. Ten seconds only. A couple of deep breaths. And we're back to the first exercise, which is your glute bridge. Here we go. One minute's begun already. That's it. So big flat, squeeze the bum. There we go. The third round. Now we're starting now. Perfect. Hips right up nice and high. Should be nice and warm now, right? Nice and warm. Now we can really focus on working the body. All the way down. Make sure butt touches the floor and then all the way up. Push through the heels as much as you can. And then let's try lifting the feet the so the toes off the floor. That's it. Now you have to push through the heels. Makes it a little bit harder. 15 seconds to go. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Ten seconds rest. Just enough time to switch over to the plank. So from the elbows to the hands. Two, one. One minute's begun. Good. Let's get those feet a little bit wider. Try and keep the hips nice and still. You can think we can draw the belly button in a little bit as well. Switch those lower abs off. Keep nice and strong through your midsection. Good. Might even be feeling this in the legs a little bit now. It's a very, very much a full body exercise, this one. Well, keep going. That's a drop to your knees. I want you to, so don't rest. If you need to, if you feel like you need a rest, make the exercise a little easier. Two, one, ten seconds. A couple of deep breaths and standing up for squats. So strict squats. Two, one minute. Here we go. That's it. Back, stay nice and straight. Strict technique squats. Let's get elbows at shoulder height. Make it a little bit harder. There we go with that. Let's get toes turned out a little bit. That's it. Let's think 80% of our body weight through the heels. Feel how that switches the glutes on a little bit more? More yep. weight on the heels. That's it. How the legs feeling now? Good. Halfway. Up and breathe out to go down. Perfect. Let's see if we can speed it up for the last 15 seconds. A little bit faster. Keep that technique nice and strong. Elbows at shoulder height. It's going to help you to keep your back straight. Let's keep those elbows up. There we go. One and ten seconds rest. Next exercise is the deep squat with the rotation. Only ten seconds three. Two, one, straight into it. Uh, imagine you're standing on a surfboard, and we want to keep the surfboard nice and level as well. So we want 50 50 left and right leg weight distribution. If you feel all your body weight coming towards the front foot, just adjust. Be really aware of how your weight is distributed through your feet. So heel toe 50-50, left right 50-50. Feet are flat and balanced. That's it. 20 seconds to go. Let's see if we can speed it up a little. Nice. And remember the breathing in time with the movement. Even though you might be feeling a little short of breath, we want to keep breathing in time with the movement. Breathe out to come down and in to come up. Good. Five seconds. Ten seconds rest. Straight back down to the ab exercise. Here we go. Three, two, one. Straight into it. One minute. So curling up into a ball and straightening out. If you're intermediate or advanced, and his PK is doing just a curl up 
with the legs staying flat. If anyone's starting to feel their lower back is really tired, please just make the exercise a little bit easier. I want you to feel it in the abs, not the lower back. You guys are doing really well though. 30 seconds in. Awesome technique. How's those tummies? Feeling more toned already, right? Fifteen seconds to go. Good. Always moving, no resting. Push through it. Don't let your body slice you. There's more there. There's always more energy. Three, two, one. Good. Standing up. Curtsies again. Straight into it. In three, two, one. Here we go. That's it. Breathe out and breathe in. back just a little bit further. A little bit more behind you. There we go. When you step a little bit further at that 45 degree angle, it's going to make it a little bit harder. Just what you wanted, right? <laughs> you guys are doing really well. Over halfway already. Let's see if we can speed it up. Starting to feel those glutes now, I bet. Yes. Good. Keep moving. I'm hoping I can walk tomorrow. I'm sure you'll be able to walk. It just might be a little bit uncomfortable. Three, two, one. And relax. That was three rounds. Who's keeping for a four? Fine. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> That's it? But thanks everyone for joining in. I'm Mike from Surf Health and Fitness. And we are surfmaymain.com and come visit our website anytime.